Hello everyone, today we're going to be doing a tutorial on reverse stick hitting. So sometimes called tomahawk hitting, where you hit the hockey ball on this edge of your hockey stick. So point one is your grip. And you don't have a conventional hockey grip with this hit. You turn it so you have more of a pan handle grip, like you're holding a frying pan cooking your pancakes. Uh, for this reason is because your stick is now going like that uh, and holding it in the normal grip way would be hitting the back of your stick which is illegal in hockey. The left hand is right at the top of the stick if you want more power and the right hand just like a forehand swing comes up close to meet the top of your left hand. Step two. Step two is uh, your leg positioning. You do a lunge into this shot. You can't hit it quite as upright as you can at a uh, forehand shot. Uh, so you do a big lunge with your right leg and twist round. The third point is ball contact. You want to hit through the center of the ball uh, and you want to hit it right on the edge of the hockey stick. You don't want to hit it slightly on the face of the hockey stick. You don't want to hit it on the back of the hockey stick. You want to hit it right on this leading edge. You'll get more power the closer to the toe that you make contact with the ball and you can do more of a sweep control thing the further away you are from the toe of the ball. You don't want to hit it on the toe, hitting it on the toe goes all over the place and it's an uncontrolled shot. You want to get it right in that sweet spot zone for most power, uh, where it's as close to the toe as it can be without hitting the toe. You can also tailor the angle of your stick uh, to get the different heights of shots. You can sometimes get low and underneath the ball, hit it just below the centre of mass to lift it up in the air. And fourth point is your backswing. Um, it is the opposite to a forehand, so it feels quite alien to people but you bring your right hand across your body, um, up across your shoulder to whip round and, uh, and give it the tomahawk power. And finally, as a tip to help you aim the ball, it depends where in line with your body you hit the ball. If the ball ends up being to the right of your right foot and you have to swing round to come onto it more, you're more likely to hit, hit the ball right. If the ball ends up being on the left side of your right foot when you plant it down, it's more likely to go straight or off to the left. 